on the victim's current condition. Tonight, word for word, an Albuquerque police officer describes a shooting earlier this year where an Albuquerque man was killed. KOAT Action 7 News anchor Royal Day has details on what the officer told investigators led him to fire. Last March, Alfred Redwine was shot and killed by APD officer James Eichel near 60th and Central. Eichel and several officers were called there after a report an armed man was threatening people. Transcripts from Eichel's debriefing, obtained by our partners at the Albuquerque Journal, show Eichel knew of Redwine before getting to the scene, saying he does not like police and it would be the fourth encounter I'd had with him. Eichel said Redwine appeared suicidal when he got there. This is APD lapel cam video. Looks like he's got a gun for his head. In the transcripts, Eichel said, I saw that looking in his eyes like he was ready for something to either shoot himself or us. Alfred, we don't want you to hurt yourself. Put the gun down. Eichel said Redwine moved the gun down from his head, then says he heard gunfire and saw a flash. So Eichel fired back, saying, I thought he was shooting at us. I reacted and fired twice. It's still not clear if Redwine shot at officers or into the ground. Neighbors and witnesses have given different accounts. Officer Eichel is now back to active duty. APD is finishing up its investigation, which will then go to the district attorney, who will decide if criminal charges will be filed. Royal Day, KOAT, Action 7 News. An autopsy shows Redwine was shot three times in the chest, stomach, and lower body. No drugs were found in Redwine's body. A toxicology report showed he had more than three times the legal limit of alcohol in his system. Another New Mexico police department.